Hello, welcome to LabVIEW Advantage. In this video, we'll learn how to perform highlight execution in LabVIEW to debug your application. As you can see, we have a small code. If we'll press the run button, we won't notice how the application has been executed. So if we'll turn on the highlight execution, we can see the step-by-step -step process of the execution of the API. Now let's try pressing pause and then run. As you can see, the pause operation will allow us to switch between different steps manually rather than automatically. So at the moment, the step over VI and step into VI are similar because there are no sub VI associated in this step. So if you'll press that one, we'll move on to the next node and continuously at the moment we can enter into the sub VI or step over the sub VI. We have been provided with this VI, but at the moment we won't be using that option. So we'll step over. So now we can exit the loop, iteration and everything. So let's try getting inside the sub VI. So from the beginning, press pause and press. As you can see, both the step over and step into are same, but when you reach the sub VI, you have two different options. So if we'll press step enter, we enter inside the sub VI. This enables us to debug everything, what is happening in each iteration at the moment, just like that. We're getting the value of the for loop into the indicator and we can exit the sub VI. So this is how we perform the highlight execution to debug our application in LabVIEW.